Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel with another interesting video. If you find this video important to you please like, share and subscribe our channel for more videos like this. In this tutorial we are going to create a swipe view with tabs using Android X ViewPager widget. Swipe view allows you to navigate between two or more screens with a horizontal swipe. For this project we will be using tabs in order to show you one use of the swiper view in a clear and easy manner. First of all we need to add required dependencies for Android X ViewPager 2. For that you need to add the following dependencies to the Gradle app. Then of course we need to create the layout for our Android project. For this we will be using Android X ViewPager 2 widget first and then we will be adding a tab layout on top of the ViewPager in order to make sure that our ViewPager is always behind the tab layout. After preparing the layout of course we need to write our coding in order to access the swiper view and assign different pages to change when you swipe the view and so on. Pages can be assigned to the ViewPager using page adapters. There are two types of default page adapters for this. Fragment Pager Adapter. Use this for a small and fixed number of consecutive screens. Fragment State Pager Adapter. Use this several and unknown number of pages. This will destroy the fragment when the user navigates away, optimizing the memory of the device. For this example we'll be using Fragment State Pager Adapter to load three fragments into our swipe view. By setting this adapter binding the child fragments you should be able to load fragment views and swipe through each fragment one by one. But since we have already added a tab layout to our example we'll be using a tab layout mediator to set up a tab indication and navigate the page according to tab selection. Now you can use the following code in your main activity to set up both view pager 2 and tab layouts. Now it's time to create three child fragments to load into the view pager. You can do this by simply creating any three fragments and load them inside the fragment state adapter in your main activity. For this example we have created three simple fragments just by changing the background color and adding a text view to indicate the tab name. You can find all the required coding for this example in the description below. After finishing everything you can run the code to compile it and execute it in an emulator or a physical Android device. This is a small video demonstration of the app we have created. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let's see you in another video like this. Thanks.